Hi guys, it's Katie, and I just got back from Wigman's, and I went to a location I don't normally go to, and I just happened to run into my midwife, so that was a nice surprise. She got to see the baby that she delivered, and it's always nice to see her, so um, I just went in and got a few things from Wigman's. I spent around $55. Um, I really want to be under budget for February, shortest month of the year, and um, so I just got what I needed, and as long as I don't have any extraneous purchases at the end of the week, I should be good and hit my budget, um, actually be under budget. So I will just go through quickly what I got here. I'll put my meal plan in the description box, but um, got some canola oil. We were running out. I always get the big jugs, best value. Got two loaves of bread, some bananas, mushrooms, got some parsley. It always kills me to buy parsley because it grows so wild in my yard, but right now it's under eight inches of snow, so I had to buy some. I got some frozen corn. I got two boxes of Earth Balance. The last like five times I've gone to Wegmans, it's been out of stock, and that's the reason why I went to the other location was um, to see if they had it, and they did have plenty, so I got two while it was available to me. I got a whole chicken to roast. I got some white potatoes mozzarella cheese for we're having pizza at the end of the week so that's for my husband I still have diet in the freezer uh, it was out of salt so I picked that up and then I found this um, when I did my uh, earth balance mac and cheese review I learned about this one and it's gluten free and I think it's mostly um, marketed as gluten free but it's also dairy free so I wanted to give this one a try as well it was $3.99 so is around the same price as the um, Earth Balance one. So I thought I would give it a try and I will definitely be reviewing this. I'm not probably gonna have this for a little while since we just had mac and cheese. Um, so maybe a couple weeks I'll try this one. And then I just got some cereal. I got uh, rice squares and then these oatmeal squares. Um, I really got this because I wanna make Muddy Buddies. So we'll either have it as cereal or I'll make Muddy Buddies. But those are all my groceries. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will put my monthly total at the end so we can all see if I actually hit my $400 a month budget. But I want to thank you all for watching and uh, be sure to subscribe, thumbs up, and leave me some comments.